how to find a new e equation under a given translation. Okay, so this says find the new equation in vertex form under the transformation t four comma negative three. Okay, so a lot of students get this confused. So a transformation is just when you have a change, and there's different types of changes, right? A translation is one change. The translation is what many teachers and students call the slide. So these numbers here tell us how to make it slide or move. Okay, so the shape is going to be in the same, or the equation is going to be in the same orientation. It's just going to move. All right, so the first thing we need to do in this case is we need to write the general equation for a parabola in vertex form. And here we go. Got to know that. Otherwise, you can't answer this question, right? So then what I did next was I rewrote the equation that was given. But I put it in this form, and I added. So this 5, look, substituted for the a, 4, it's the h. This 0 is k. See how there's nothing here? So for some people, they like to put the plus 0 to help them, help them visualize, oh, that's where the k goes. OK, you don't have to, but it helps some, a lot of people. Now what we need to do is we need to take a look at these values right here. And we need to add those values to the h and k values. OK? So the x number is the one that goes with the h, right? So it's good to remember that this goes with this, OK? So when I go here, notice I put extra parentheses here, right? So this is already minus 4. OK, so I put parentheses here to show that this is a positive 4, so you add these. But actually, the final will become negative, as you'll see. And then this one is minus 3, OK? Now, why? Hopefully, your teacher showed you this. But remember, when it's when you have values in here, OK, inside the parentheses, it's the opposite, right? So if this is minus 8, when you are plotting it, that's going to be positive 8. Okay, all right. But for the value outside the parentheses, if it's minus here, that means the sign is going to be a minus or negative three when you are plotting it. Okay, a lot of students get this trick and they get these wrong. Okay, so watch out for that. All right, and that completes our problem.